My team has seven snipers. I should play sniper. When you first start up TF2, make sure to play the tutorial. This is the objectively fastest way to learn how to play all four of TF2's playable classes. The rest of the classes will only be played by bots, so don't worry about those ones. From here, it's important to pick up every weapon. Head to the Manco store and buy all of them. It'll cost 213 euro and 45 cents! But it's by far the easiest way to obtain them. After this, you're ready to play. So click casual mode and uncheck everything that isn't captured a flag. You want to make sure you're playing only the best game mode DF2 has to offer. Once you arrive on 2 Fort, it's time to learn the basics. Team Fortress 2 is a game all about balance and cooperation. Check the classes your team already has, then pick whatever you felt like playing anyway. The rest of your team will no doubt change class to accommodate for you. Once you've chosen to play Sniper, head to the battlements and choose your spot. Then go into your keybinds and unbind everything related to movement. Then right click to aim down your scope and happy days. Although TF2 is commonly called an FPS, it's secretly a point and click adventure game developed by Telltale. Occasionally as you stand still, you may hear an announcer mention something about an intelligence being stolen. Don't mind her and continue what you're doing. The main objective in TF2 is to simply rack up the highest amount of points possible and to be top of the leaderboard. Nothing else matters. Should your team lose the round, it's important to provide constructive criticism to assist your team in the next round. This can be easily achieved by pressing T on your keyboard, voicing your criticism, and doing nothing to change the inevitable outcome of the second round. If this form of criticism fails, then you can go the extra step. Designate a player to be in special need of criticism. Open the main menu and call a vote kick on that person. This will help them to learn how to play more effectively, and they will no doubt personally thank you. If you feel like playing something different to assist your teammates by providing additional help, you can never go wrong with the Sandwich Heavy. For this playstyle, equip the Sandwich on Heavy and just pretend that your minigun doesn't exist. This strategy works best if you also place a brick on your crouch key to ensure you move at the slowest possible speed. Spamming voice commands will also assist your teammates by informing them that you are capable of healing. If you're feeling particularly brave, you can try a more offensive playstyle. Unequip your Sandwich and replace it with the default shotgun. This will let you move at high speeds as heavy, while dealing far more damage than that of a ham sandwich. By this stage, you should almost be a master of Team Fortress 2. So it's time for the advanced strategies. The Spy is a master of stealth that can disguise himself as any player on the enemy team, as well as instantly kill any player with a backstab. To play the class best, equip only the knife and constantly run at the enemy. This will help you earn backstabs faster. Should things take a turn for the worse, you can always seek assistance from your teammates by repeatedly pressing the E key. This handy button informs any ally medics on your team that you are in need of assistance and they will no doubt rush to your aid before you die anyway. For a more defensive strategy, build a sentry on the objective as an engineer and leave your computer to go make a coffee. You literally don't need to do anything else, and you'll just instantly win. If you're feeling a bit tired of Team Deathmatch, you can check out TF2's other game modes. These include Robot Wars and Queuing at the Bank to deposit money into your account simulator. And congratulations! You're now a master of Team Fortress 2 and sent to impart your knowledge to other players. The best way to display your newfound knowledge is by writing a keybind text message you can use after each kill which informs others you are better than them. This will earn you the untold respect of your teammates and will work even better by fully equipping your character with cosmetics, painting them lime, and wielding a conscientious objector that no doubt has an anime decal.